previous camper trailer had a really convenient swing out Weber mounting arm, which meant we got used to using the Weber nearly every trip and every meal. When getting our T-Van, one of our priorities was to come up with a similar mounting arrangement for the Weber to make sure that we could access it quickly, use it efficiently and pack it away just as easily. We also wanted to avoid keeping the Weber inside the T-Van cabin because we didn't want cooking smells in where we were going to sleep. We targeted use of the right-hand front storage locker for keeping the Weber, but we didn't want to sterilise the whole drawer. So we came up with a mounting frame that mounts the Weber on top of the drawer while still leaving storage space underneath it. The storage frame is a pretty simple fabrication using 40 by 40 millimeter steel angle iron with some 40 millimeter steel flat pieces to create a cradle that the Weber feet fit into in both a storage position and then widthways in a cooking position. After cutting and cleaning up the pieces of steel, I tack it together and take some measurements to make sure that everything is square. Once the brackets are welded out, I clean them up with some degreaser, prime them and finish them off with some gloss black enamel. Install some M6 nut certs into the top edge of the drawer, then mount the brackets using M6 cap screws. It's going to make the weather a whole lot more accessible and usable. If you're not already onto them, these undercover plate bags are the go. Store your bags with this carpet liner in between them and they stop them and they stop your bag your plates from bashing around when you're driving on rough roads and 
end up falling down onto your fire ring and damaging that so I always put them in these carry bags they sit in there beautifully and the whole thing stows for transport I use a 4 meter long extension hose with quick connect fittings so that the Weber can pick up its gas supply from the same outlet as used for the T-band kitchen. There's a three-way splitter that I use here so that I can use the Weber and the gas stove at the same time. The Weber is a really neat fit in the drawer and there's barely enough room for it to move around. But I always put a couple of Oki straps across it just to tie it into the drawer for those rough tracks. Well, that's this project finish. If you want to catch up with any of our T-Van touring or some of the other tips and tricks, jump onto our YouTube channel or subscribe so you always get notified when something new is posted. So